back with another video and today i'm gonna be doing a slip back ponytail with weave but yeah this is how it's looking so far i mean it's, it's in the middle of my head it's not that high not that low but yeah, it's cute but if y'all want to see how i did this down make sure you keep watching make sure you like comment and subscribe i both blow dry my hair and i flat ironed it off camera but right now i'm going to show y'all the things i'm going to use for the ponytail so the first i'm going to use is this got to be glue spray free spray these styling strips black ones um super hair bond glue an edge brush a regular brush um a rat tail comb I have this Murray's Edge Wax and the 24 Hour Edge Tamer. And I have these bundles, 20 inch bundles, two of them from YOLO, 365. And I have a comb and a clip in case. First thing I'm going to do is just comb my hair, comb my hair up. Cause right now I had a part in it, but just comb it up. And then, and y'all, I'm a um, beginner. I'm not a professional, so I'm just trying my first time. Well, actually doing it with straight hair. So yeah, I want my um, ponytail to be like in the middle, like right here, I think. Yeah, so I'm gonna just hold it up, I guess, and then comb it. And then I'm gonna just take out some edges first before anything else. I'm use my little um, red tail comb. Take them. I want um dramatic edges on this hairstyle. Let me just take the side out a little bit. Alright, so right now I'ma uh, spray my got to be glue spray. Yeah, I'm gonna do the back first. And then put the comb at the end of this thing. I can't even see what the back looks like. But I'm gonna try to make it as sleek as possible. I'm gonna use a brush too. Alright, you know I'm gonna do the other side. I hope it looks cute at the end. So once I got it to my liking for right now, I'm going to put the ponytail holder. This is what it's looking like right now. So I got my um, ponytail holder right here. And I'm going to just put it up.
Look at the fly leaves coming. Alright, I'm gonna um, do this again, spray it a little bit more. Try out this thing, slick, slick. Let me just take this. Let's go like this to put the flowery back. I'm gonna just take this Murray's Age Wax to just go in. Try to make it extra sleek. Alright. I'm putting it around my leg. done once that's done I'm gonna take this hair up here and I'm gonna just braid it just a regular braid then once I get to the end I'm gonna put a rubber band on the bottom so it come out wrap it like three or four times on the bottom. Alright, so this is what my braid is looking like. And then I'm gonna just wrap it with the black strip. See, these always fall for me. Yeah, I'm gonna wrap it with the black strip. Alright, so I'm gonna um, wrap the black styling strip around the braid. I'm gonna start from the bottom, then go up. Watch the breakdown. This is um loose way or something like that. All right, so this is what the hair looks like. This is twenty inches too. I think I might use like one and a half bundles. I'm not sure. All right, so I got it unwrapped now. Now I'm just doubling it up. And I'm gonna start with this side like this. Hopefully this come out good because I ain't got no color today, nothing. So I'm gonna put the glue on the tracks. Put it at the end, then wrap up. 
Alright. This might take a little minute, but I'm sorry. wrap it at the top so you don't see the track. Hold up. Just wrap it so you don't see the um, hair tie or track or anything like that. Yeah, I didn't think that wrapping the weave was going to be that hard, but I was struggling. So I'm just going to wrap it. And just tuck it under all the wrapping I just did. Alright, so I don't know if y'all can see. But this is what it's looking like. The little wrap part is right there. Hopefully I got everything. Because this has been a struggle. Alright. So right now, y'all, since everything this is done, now I'm going to do the edges. So I'm going to take my 24 hour. Um, 24 hour edge tamer and my edge brush and do the edges like this much and I'm gonna just swoop the edges you ain't got too big it's cute, whatever. The next one. I'm take the comb part. I'm gonna try to get one right here, even though I ain't taking enough hair out. Sorry, right, though. Alright, I'm gonna try to get a little one right here. Get a little more edge thing. Just swoop it. I'm gonna do the other side.
for that one too, so alright. Now I'm going to just take one of these little things to lay down the edges and the tie in the back. Alright, so the edges can be laid. And now this part is optional, but I'm going to use my curling wand to make some curls in the thing. I'm gonna put it at 420 to just do some curls. Cause this, you can leave it like this, but it's not really that curly anymore. So while I let that heat up, I'm gonna um, put my, um, what's her name? My um, thermal gloves, whatever you call it. All right. Heating up fast, man. You're supposed to protect it from the heat before the thing. Alright, so the water is hot now. So I'm gonna just take it. I'm gonna just put it around. I don't know how long this is holding for. For the heat. Oh, it did it a little bit. I know y'all see that little curl. Don't play with me. Alright, so I'm gonna just do it to the whole ponytail, I guess. It's gonna take a little minute. cute so yeah, yeah this is how the hairstyle turned out it's cute let me turn this off before yeah this is looking like look cute thank you guys for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe and stay tuned